Hello everyone. Welcome to Akamos Londar. This is Divya. In this lesson, I am going to discuss about the fundamentals of accounting. That is, double entry bookkeeping. So, this lesson will be helpful for plus one students and those who are studying accounting for the first time. In this lesson, I am going to discuss about the meaning of bookkeeping, what is bookkeeping and why bookkeeping and some other details. So, let's start the lesson. What is bookkeeping? Bookkeeping means recording business transactions in a set of books. Okay. Only the recording of transaction is done. When we, uh, you might have seen at your home that your father or mother will be recording the expenses that they had incurred in a particular month in, uh, in their personal diary or in a notebook. And at the end of the month, they will get an idea how much money they had spent or is there any savings. And also they can compare that with the uh, previous months. So they will get an idea whether they had uh, spent more money this month compared to the previous month. All these things. Likewise, a businessman, he, when he keeps his books or when he records these transactions in a set of books, he will also get an exact idea about the financial position of his business. Earlier, our ancestors uh, were following the barter system, that is exchanging goods for goods. If we have something in excess in our hand, we can exchange that with uh, any other person who have something that is not with us. We can exchange goods for goods. Our ancestors were following this system, but it was not possible because we can't value um, a particular thing with another in the terms of uh, in terms of quantity. We need a medium. For that, currency was introduced earlier. There were there were pebbles, metal, uh, metals like that. But now we reach the era of currency and uh, now uh, we are using currency as the medium. But when the transactions uh, also, see friends, the number of transactions earlier were very less compared to now. Now it is numerous transactions. So for a businessman, uh, memorizing all these transactions, all these numerous transactions is not possible. So he needs to record that in a book. So that recording of these transactions in a set of books is known as bookkeeping. Accounting is much advanced than bookkeeping. So bookkeeping, we can say that bookkeeping is a part of accounting. Okay. So, you get an idea about what is bookkeeping. It means recording monetary transactions. Okay, monetary transactions in a set of books. Now, we will see why bookkeeping. Why we are keeping these books? Already I said that when a, a businessman keeps his books, he will get an idea uh, about the exact financial position of his business. Okay, so we record all the business dealings in a set of books and thus we can ascertain the actual financial position of the business. That is, it helps to ascertain whether the business had gain or uh, it incurred a loss and also the amount uh, gained or the amount lost. So the profit and loss can be ascertained by keeping these books. Not only that, the amount of assets, the amount of liabilities and the capital of the business. All this can be understood by keeping books, by recording these, all the transactions in a set of books. Beyond that, in the case of a businessman, he should also know how he gained such an amount or how he incurred such a loss. He need to ascertain all these things because he need to draft uh, tactics or he need to draft his policies, business policies. 
So for that, we need to understand how he gained such an amount, how he incurred such a loss. Not only that, he need to, uh, need to get an idea about the amount that he lent to his customers. Also, the amount that he borrowed from his lenders. In order to get all these informations, he need to keep the books. He need to record these transactions. So for all these things, he follows double entry system of booking. That is, each and every transaction is given two aspects, a debit aspect and a credit aspect. Okay, so let's see in detail what is double entry system of bookkeeping. It is the only system of bookkeeping with which all the above mentioned objects can be achieved. That is, to ascertain the profit or loss, to uh, understand the amount of uh, assets within the firm, the amount of liabilities, the capital of the business, all these things and also the creditors, the amount of credit, the amount of debit, that is how much amount he had lent it to his customers, how much he borrowed from his lenders. All these informations can be collected or can be uh, gained with the help of this bookkeeping. With the help of this double entry system of bookkeeping. It enables the trader to obtain a permanent record of all the dealings or all the transactions with whom he transacts his business and the exact status of that relationship that is whether that particular uh, company's uh, our creditor or our de debtor all this can be understood okay so for this double entry system of bookkeeping is needed not only that it further helps the businessman to ascertain whether the result of his transactions has been profitable or not and his exact financial position exact financial position of his business okay so uh, i said that it is a double entry system that is two aspects are there uh, i will explain that with an example that if we have purchased if we purchase something purchased uh, a furniture so the furniture uh, comes into the business but from the business the money is going out isn't it so we are recording both these we purchased a furniture we gave away the money we are recording both these aspects of our, that particular uh, single transaction that is called double entry system of bookkeeping okay and you will get an idea uh, in the in further lessons so for now uh, think that each and every transaction has two aspects one debit aspect and one credit aspect i will explain further in the in coming lessons so hope this lesson is helpful for you and if you like my lesson please give me a like please share the lesson with your friends and please don't forget to subscribe my channel also press the bell icon to get all the video notifications so thanks for watching and if you have any doubt please uh, leave a comment thank you